Detroit rested did not play in Denver last night game postponed and Plumlee wins the tip easily here we go his career average is over 21 a game he's averaging 12 and a half that inside game's kind of just worn away it's going to be an outside shot Donovan speaking of outside takes his first three and nails it and fifty dollars for the Huntsman Cancer Foundation Mountain America guiding their members forward for more than 80 years well we talk about the Jazz coming out nice pass down low the cutter Ellington He's in his 11th year, but it's really Jeremy Grant's team right now with Blake trying to help him out. Good yeah. defense by Bogey down low. Dishes inside. Bucket, count it. Plumley will be at the line. But well, that's where Blake Griffin's really good. 53% shooting for the Jazz. 29 for Denver. Rudy inside. Nice touch. Yeah, they're really coming easy this first quarter. Detroit not doing a very good job of keeping the Jazz out of the paint. Ball tapped up, Jez have to hurry. Gobert clears. Well, Rudy's free throw shooting beginning to pick up. In fact, his last five. You know, usually the trouble's been the front end. Gobert denied. And we've been talking about this for a while about that free flowing part of his game. I spoke to Coach Quinn Snyder today about that and he said, well, he's worked so hard to become this level to where it's instinctual, his footwork, his pull up. Magruder picked up the foul as first and Rudy back at the line and there he is making that first one. And the NBA Players Association T and the league getting very close. Rolls in on Rudy. Fresh off the bench, stands his ground, forces the pass out. Jeremy Grant, bodied up by O'Neal. Plumley, the hook shot, short, rebound, go bear. And the first two quarters of play, Donovan on a stop and go drive, feeds it to go bear right off his hands, and Utah will turn it over. He's a surprising three point shooter, great defender, right corner, three ball out, and Rudy with the rebound. Donovan drives in, dish off, Gobert off his hands. Boyan putting together his third strong consecutive game as we get back to action now. Third quarter, and the Jazz lead by 23. Make it 25 on the Gobert dunk. And Thurl, this is where the Jazz again, you know, 23 points, and, and Quinn will say this often, it's not much of a lead, 18 to 20. Griffin hit the three, wide open three. Five of the half, five here in the third. Conley comes up short, ball batted down. Rudy is there, knocked out of his hands by Plumley. Griffin hit the three, wide open three. Five of the half, five here in the third. Conley comes up short, ball batted down. Rudy is there, knocked out of his hands by Plumley. Detroit trying to find some confidence here in Salt Lake. Grant, no. Rudy runs the floor, grabs a rebound. Thurl, just how he's really calmed himself down with officials this year and getting back on the defensive end. So Gobert will shoot two. Here's the first one. And it's up and good. And it, the ongoing pursuit of racial justice by elevating voices and experiences of black players, coaches, and yes, fans. Grant puts his shoulder into Royce. Plumley in the paint. Hook it up over Gobert. Off she comes, Rudy grabs a rebound, his seventh. Magruder on a pass inside. A little wild, little playground. Double pump, thought he walked. Gobert timed it perfectly, but Detroit got it back in the bucket by Stewart. You know, that's, that's I think, tough for a star in the making, a young star, an all-star last year as Gobert tries to flush it home from Joe. Inside lob, Rudy dumps it back down low. Oh, beautiful bucket. Somehow, I, I lost him in the timber. Detroit to get this into single digits. Rudy turns it over. Right, front court, leads it to Blake. Well rested, they go to the corner. Three ball, down. 36% from three. Blake Griffin, double pump, glass. It's off the mark, and who's going to chase it down? It's going to be off 